Yeah, yeah first year of the program, um, I think the opportunities lie um, with me being able to instill like a good team culture. So I think um, there's a ton of opportunities that Aver has, um, and I really look on forward like, to working with those for sure. Well, some of the challenges that I face um, as a first year head coach is kind of just learning as I'm going on with it. Um, you know, it's going to be a learning process for everyone with a uh, new coach. Um, the athletes are going to be learning kind of a new training plan. Um, I'm going to be learning a little bit more about my athletes. So um, there's going to be a lot to learn, but I think um, the first year uh, will go really good. I think me and the athletes are going to work together well um, to have a good first year. So far it's going really great. Um, I expect to see, you know, some like stepping up. He's done really well with communication. And I feel like as long as we continue to improve on that with him, then it's going to be a good season. Well, I would say um, with any experience um, in the world of running can come with a lot of um, forward progress um, quicker than other sports. Um, so someone that's really not familiar with cross country, um, just a little bit of training and a little bit of consistency, um, they can really absorb that. And um, I think that we're going to have a lot of surprises as far as um, you know, where they were at the beginning of the year to where they're going to be um, at the end of the year. Yeah, so the development is obviously key. That's what kind of keeps the program running. Um, mm -hmm. If you're not developing your athletes, then you're not developing a program. Um, and for me, this first year, if it looks the same in three years, then, you know, we weren't developing right. So development's key. Um, each year we want our athletes getting better. We want to bring in uh, better athletes um, just to kind of take our program to that next level. Definitely motivation. It makes me want to be better for my for my other athletes and better for my teammates. One other thing is always being there for them, both in the classroom and on the track and things like that. Um, I feel like as long as I'm there for them, not just as a teammate but as a friend, uh, we can have a really good season, a really good connection. So do their best. Uh, I always want to see everybody improve and you know put their best foot forward. As a team, um, that's something we're going to sit around and talk about more as a group. But um, for me, what I would like to see from the team is a lot of uh, pack running um, in a sense. So what that means is when the races are going, I want a, a bunch of, of blue and gold jerseys together. That way we're kind of learning how to run together. Um, we're running like a team. Building off of what I've been here for, um, definitely putting everything I have into this season and making it something bigger than me. The first meet September 1st. I'm um, really looking forward to that. That's going to be our kind of real big first test of fitness-wise, where we're at, how we're going to race, um, learn a little bit more of our team that way. But really, um, for cross country, what we're training for all year long is um, the postseason. So USA, South, um, the conference championship, and regionals and stuff. So those are the big the big hitters for us. Um, you know, the meets before that, all regular seasons kind of just practice gearing up towards, you know, that championship season.